Hi guys, this is Daniel from FND. In this video, we are going to see how to outpaint a flux image. That is how to expand your flux image. So let's get started. First, we need to generate one image from flux. For that, I'm going to use TensorArt. So go to TensorArt. I drop a link in the description. If you want extra credits, you can uh, use my link. Click on get more credits and uh, sign up with your Google account or any other email account you have. So after uh, sign up, Click on create and you will get this page. Here you need to type in your prompt to generate image. Select the flux model over here and type in the prompt. So this is the prompt I'm gonna give. A middle-aged spaceman wearing red wool helmet standing in the corn field. You can use expand and improve prompt. So I'm gonna do that. And it is uh, expanded the prompt. A close-up shot of a rugged middle-aged spaceman donning a red wool helmet. So it is expanded the prompt. I'm gonna generate two images so that we can select one from that. Click on generate. So these two images are uh, generated. So it generated wool as a text. I want that as a fabric. Since the wool is given in apostrophe, it is taken as a text, so I'm gonna remove that. I'm gonna give as red wool helmet. Let's try again. So I made just uh, some adjustment in the prompt and I got this result. So I like this one, so I'm gonna download this. Click on here to download. So now you want the same image to be outpainted. You need to go to huggingface.co and then log in with your account. Then search for flex out painting. So you can see in the spaces we have flux out painting. It is created by multi-model art. So thanks to them for creating this model. Here you need to drop your image. I'm gonna click and drop. Here you can add your prompt. So this prompt is optional. You can add or you don't need to add prompts. So you can change the expected ratio over here. So this is the portrait image. I'm gonna make it to landscape. 16 is to 9 is the landscape ratio then drop down the advanced settings we have many different advanced settings you can uh, adjust the targeted width and targeted height if you adjust the targeted width and height it is automatically changed to custom instead i'm gonna go with 16 is to 9 ratio for steps i'm gonna use 12 and while clicking preview alignment and mask drop down this and it will generate one mask preview so this whole canvas is 16 to 9 landscape image here the image will be outpainted here and it took out the reference of these areas you can see these areas so this part of the image will not be touched by outpainting but these areas outside this portion will be taken for reference to create out painting also here the alignment is given as middle if you change to left means then again click on preview alignment and mask it will move that image to the left same as right top and bottom so let me try right align i'm not on this part this bottom part to be add to the reference since we are going to out paint the corn field this bottom part need not to be in the reference so i'm gonna go over mask overlap then i'm gonna remove overlap bottom then again click on preview alignment and mask and you can see that area removed from the reference i don't know you can see that from the video but if you try you can see and mask overlap percentage is amount of reference to be taken let me show you i'm gonna increase to 20 percent and it will take more reference from the image so i'm gonna keep that to 10 percent maybe i'm gonna add a little bit maybe i'm gonna give maybe 12 percent is enough click preview alignment and mask and okay so i'm gonna click on generate without giving prompt and here is the result so this one is uh kind of okay you can see it uh generated the and perfectly some issues in the perspective this grass are looking very tall maybe i'm gonna make the character to the middle middle okay then we can also resize input image that means now resize is in full if we press 50 percent means you can see it will generate zoom out out painting let's try 25 percent so it is very small you can also give custom person like i'm gonna give something like 
85%. So this will work. Let's try, this time I'm going to give the prompt. Okay, this one is kind of looking great. So this is how we can outpaint flux images. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, give a thumbs up. Subscribe this channel for uh, more future tutorials. Also press the bell icon so that you can get instant notification when I upload your video. Thanks for watching and bye.